It's now we live. Dream the impossible. Dream. It's, it's not right. impossible. Shut up. It's impossible. So it's let me check. So now we're live, but where's the link? I see here. Okay. Bro, Chad is deserved for the live. Oh why? Hey, un segundo que voy a mirar porque está desactivado el, el live, el chat. Eh, el room. Uh, no, un segundo que quiero ver porque está el chat desactivado. Oh, aquí está el chat. Ustedes pueden escribir, si alguien es, eh, de los que están viendo en estos momentos, pueden hacer, escribir alguna cosa en el chat para yo ver de que te vean a vos. I forgot if you didn't speak Spanish. Thought, no, yeah. I don't speak Spanish, sorry. Eh, ¿Cómo sé si pueden escribir? Hey, alguien que esté, por favor, escriba en el chat. Quiero saber si se está viendo, si están escribiendo a alguien en el chat, que no, no veo el chat activo. Normally, ah, ya yeah, yeah. Ok, ahora, ok. Ok. Eh, voy a intentar hablar en español, en inglés, porque este tonto no habla español. I say this Hola. asshole. I say this asshole doesn't speak Spanish. Okay. So, eh, él es Chris, él trabaja, me to here. So, él es Chris, él es modelador, pero no es, yo me di cuenta que no es solamente modelador, él es generalista, pero en micros, él es senior, eh, modeler. So, vamos a intentar, voy a intentar es traducir un poco, si ustedes no hablan inglés, me intentan escribir de pronto lo que no entendieron, pero vamos a intentar eh, hablar un poquito con Chris en español y en inglés, ¿ok? Entonces, eh, si algo esperemos un segundo, ah, bueno, aquí podemos ver. Hey. Uh, he's uh, some friend, he's a Mex Argentina guy too, who okay. work in layout. So, vamos a empezar de una vez. Um, So, Chris, what do you tell about the people uh, you experience? Uh, okay. Uh, ustedes no vieron el portafolio del que lo tiene el, este <coughs> oculto, pero por ejemplo el trabajo en Avatar, uh, what's the other movie you tell me? Like a movie what the wild things are? Yeah. Uh, another cool project. The problem, he, the, el problema con él es que su portafolio tiene eh, privado porque, eh, for copyright, I believe so. Why is it real? Is it real? Yeah, some stuff, yeah two or three projects which are like not released yet so okay. I, i can't show the whole real one uh, yeah. so why didn't chris va a hablar un poquito sobre su background donde ha trabajado él entonces chris why tell about you uh, where you're from i'm from um, london I'm from london i started my job in vfx my career uh in london uh started first with the uh, layout and tracking and match move Then I moved to Luxembourg in Europe to to animation, animation, character animation for a TV series. And then I moved to modeling. Uh, and I've also done the yeah, texture and shading, but mostly modeling from uh, he, for the last six years. Do you know to J2? Do you know hair too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like But I, it's because I worked in a small company, so we had to do could, everything. Yeah, yeah, we had to do everything. Like, yeah. Lo mismo que hacemos like, en Colombia, tú que hacer todo, you have to do everything. Yeah. Uh, Creo que lo bueno de, de, de Chris es que Chris nos puede dar una experiencia sobre la, la opinión de él que piensa sobre generalista o ser especialista. Que, porque en su reel es generalista, pero él se ha empezado a enfocar. ¿Qué piensas sobre las personas que son generalistas? ¿Tienes el consejo para las personas que son generalistas o que se enfocan en una cosa? ¿O qué te aconsejas? Creo que depende. Si eres un artista más primero, y más técnico y más artista, I think it's okay that you can be generalist. It's okay, but you need to start with one specialization first, and then you can add more. Uh, I think as you go along, you know. The problem for me, I say always, you need too, too many years to gain like a good yeah, experience. Yeah, yeah. I have to be good. First, you have to focus on one thing for sure. But this be good at one thing, and then if you if you are successful, and you if you, for example, work in a small company, you can uh, add you uh, more things. But this is the thing, if you work in small companies, I think it's, it's better for you if you're generalist, but with big companies, you have to you fight. Have to, you have to, yeah, there's no choice. In a big company, you have no choice. In it's, VFX, for example, you do one thing and that's it. Lo que dice Chris, no sé lo que ha entendido, es lo que yo siempre he pensado y lo que yo he visto. 
cuando trabajo en compañías pequeñas, sobre todo en Colombia, compañías eh, en small companies, uh, sí es bueno ser generalista. Y eso que en Colombia está cambiando un poquitico la, la, la onda de ser generalista. Pero él dice que en compañías pequeñas, ¿where are you, where are you working in small companies? En Luxembourg. Luxembourg. Yeah. Eh, es como Colombia, que tiene que hacer de todo. Por eso él sabe Yeti, sabe Texture y Animation, todas esas cosas. Pero en empresas grandes como Micros o en empresas de films, lo mejor y casi que necesita eh, ser específico en, en un área. En este caso, eh, él es modelador, el senior model. Eh, for example, um, what the advice for, I always say the, thing, the same thing about uh, the, the reel. How you submit the reel, how long, the music, or what wow. shots. So for, for modeling, in, the, in this case, we, we want to talk about modeling. Yeah, yeah we should focus on uh, So what advice to do the reel for modeling? You need tables, to, yeah, if it's really just a modeling reel, I would focus on maybe two or three good models. Maybe one character. If it's character, really a nice character, put it in a pose. Don't do a T-pose if you can help it. Uh, a dynamic pose would be nice, right, to show the, the personality of the character. And, stuff. and you want to show the why as well. So it's better to focus on one, two, three good pieces rather than ten, of models. If you work in a production, for example, and you want to use those in your reel, uh, yeah, you don't want to show all of them. Just show the the one, two, three good ones, and 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 do a turntable. But then cut in with the camera, and maybe crop the face. Uh, you know, not just and, turntable. Like yeah, that. show show the details. I never do tipos. This is well, like, it's okay. This is, I will do always tipos. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but if you if you can, it's much better to take that character into a pose and show some kind of action. You know. Funny to say, how many years experience do you have? Uh, it's it's like nine years, ten years in in the industry, but six in modeling. Six in modeling, a lot. Um, maybe we can. Maybe we can share you real, but just parts or, or you no, are taking. Give them, give them the link. It's fine. Yeah, put the link on the, on the chat. Okay, I wanna I wanna share with you guys the link that he's real. Please don't don't pause any, anywhere. It's private for copyright. So I wanna share exactly real. It really, it's really good. I and he do. Right, it's not the best. Huh? I, I forget. Saben en español, en inglés con ellos. Es súper bueno el portafolio de ellos. Por favor, este no, no lo publiquen. O sea, compártanlo si quieren, pero compártanlo entre ustedes, en, entre amigos. Pero no, no lo muestren. Voy a buscar el reel de él que lo tengo por aquí en el chat. Este es Lortation. Es here. Ok. Eh, voy a compartir con ustedes acá. Esta... Well, this is maybe not the best example because it's, it's a. Everything. It's not just modeling, but you will see in this reel there is some typos. There is also some others which is animated, but this animation is not mine. Aquí compartir el portafolio de él. Um, so, another question like I think is really important for the people is normally in your interviews. What they ask, or what you advise for people to do interviews. For me, interviews is you have to first have good read, uh, other like a pass your interview. So I have to it's two steps to get in the job. Yeah, uh, you have to act interested, and you have to uh, you have to seem like the guy that they want to work with, right? Es que eso que es, y eso es lo que yo he visto sobre todo acá en entrevistas. Creo que es una algo fundamental es the skills, pero sobre todo que se lleve bien con la persona que sea friendly la que tiene que ser con, tiene que ser, que le puede gustar trabajar con alguien o sea you have to be comfortable with this person if you don't yeah. have control for with the other person you don't want to hire with people don't want to be, maybe it's good but you don't feel like a like a good feelings uh, you don't want yeah, to work with you him. have to work with this person for six months or or more so at least so you have to be it's best if they think you're a nice guy it's acting. Yeah, you can pretend. If you're not a nice guy, you can pretend. But <laughs> <laughs> at some point, they will catch. Yeah. And do you work before with like a like a Colombian, South American people, like a Mexican, or this is the first time? I work before with Spanish people in Europe. There are not that many, but a lot of French and some Spanish. Yeah, 
Spanish, no, 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 Spanish, no, no, no. not South American. Not like Spanish, Spanish. Si tiene alguna pregunta, ponla en el chat. En el momento va a seguir haciendo otras preguntas a Chris. Así que, si you want any question, uh, write in the chat. The meantime, ah, you know what? Deme un segundo. Well, I forgot to. Se me olvidó postear eso. Un segundo va a postear. I forgot to post in que we are live. So okay, maybe okay. more people getting. I could be forgot. Um, este, hey, qué pena que llegamos tarde, sino que estábamos comiendo, como salimos de trabajar, fuimos a comer algo, entonces se nos hizo tarde. Uh, I apologize que we're getting late to... Actually, we, we no, no terminamos la comida, nos tocó traer eh, la comida. Uh, un segundo, estoy comprendiendo acá el post aquí. Qué pena que todo eso fue súper rápido hoy. Ok. Um, other question. For example, you have the same problem with us. Like, uh, you need like, a visa too. Yeah, the same problem, yeah. Because I'm from Europe, so. Super. But the only problem you don't. So, you know, you have the problem with visa, but what is your. What you have to do? Or the company normally do for everything for you? Well, here the company did everything for me, but I don't know if it's always like that. It's my well, first job in uh, Canada, so. In other, in other countries, you're the first time out uh, Well, way. in Europe, we, we have free movement, so we uh, can yeah. move uh, easy between countries. At least we could, with Brexit, maybe not, but. Yeah. Lo que, por ejemplo, lo que yo he visto es que antes creo que era muy difícil salir de Colombia, pero cada vez creo que hay más convenios con Colombia, entonces, si tiene un buen portafolio, puede conseguir. But for example, for your visa, they don't require, like, for example, your school. So they, they ask about your um, certificate with your school. No, no, they don't no. ask me for anything. For example, for us, they always they ask. ask for, yeah, uh, yeah, for yeah not the company, but the, the lawyers, they say, they ask about this so they can easy get in their visa, our visa. To the border, I, they didn't ask me for anything. No, like the that. border, no, the lawyers to apply for the visa. Ah, uh, no. No, no she, she just took my CV and my wow. passport and... But with us, they have, they ask you, hey, you have to you have the... the, the uh, not yeah. the proof, but it's more easy because they have to prove they can find somebody here, they have to find... Ah, yeah, they have yeah. to look for somebody. Yeah, yeah. Out there. Maybe because I had experience, maybe you too, we had experience, yeah, so it may be easier, but if you have nothing... No, but for me too, I have experience, I have actually an American resident, they asked me about all this kind of crap. Okay. Maybe we have like a stand in Colombia. Yeah, yeah that's why. <laughs> Colombia. Uh, Edwin, bien. Si tienes alguna pregunta, eh, la podemos hacer a Chris. Hola. Hola. Yeah, hola putos. Hola putos. Hola putico. Soy un putito. <laughs> <laughs> But the, he's gay, so he's, he's okay. Uh, he thinks. He wishes. <laughs> Luis, yeah, ¿cuál es su programa favorito? Ah, okay. What do you favor uh, so far for modeling? Or what normally, I, I forgot to ask, we should start getting actually focused about the pipeline. Normally, what do you favor so far to modeling? And normally, why is the pipeline to work in, in film in modeling? Or how normally you work? In, in animation, I mean, generally, we will keep as much as possible the same topology for every character. So actually, It gets easier because we are reusing the same mesh and modifying it for each character to keep the same, for rigging to be easier and for animation to be good. And, uh, but what is okay, my favorite so thing to model? No, what, what favorite software? But before I came here, I was using Mudbox and Maya, but now here they're using ZBrush, so I learned ZBrush. Are you just learning ZBrush? Yeah, when I came here. But you this never, is something important, you, you actually. You never learned ZBrush? Before now. Fuck that, you retard or what? Most people no, 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 use no, no, no. My box is fine. But this is the important thing. If you are a good modeler, it doesn't matter which it's software you use. It's not important. The, the, the result is important. They, they, this is what happened with me. For example, I never use Mari. They teach me Mari. So they know my skills. They can use my skill for other software. So yeah. they your skills. They can teach you. They spend yeah, yeah. a few days. So you can transfer like XGen to Yeti. Like, this is what happened with me. Yeah. It's the same anyway. The result. 
you just take maybe one, two weeks or maybe a month to learn enough the software to use it, and you can do the same. But what do you, the software you prefer? Mod look or ZBrush? Yeah, now ZBrush for sure. It was much better, yeah. Este, eh, él antes trabajaba con Modbox y aquí le tocó aprender Cirrus. Lo que decía es que él antes hacía con Modbox y se pasó por Cirrus, pero que en últimas no importa cuál software a ustedes eh, les guste, porque en últimas puede hacer lo mismo y le, a él por ejemplo le enseñaron Cirrus, no hay ningún problema. ¿Y qué otra cosa? Es verdad, el tema de interrumpir. ¿El software no es importante? Sí, el software no es importante, sino la, la calidad. Pero si tienes la chance. Now I would say focus more on Maya than like 3ds Max and Softly Motion, for example. Maya, it's more. You heard that? I don't say nothing. Did you escuch them? I always had a problem. No problem. I always say Max is a fucking virus. Yeah. Si ve, no nos mentiras. Maya es Maya siempre mejor que Max. Bueno, Max es bueno para otras mierdas, pero para trabajar en films o en industria es mejor este Maya. First characters, this. yeah. Well, no, no. generally, I, I focus on characters. How about this my, other question on oh. campus, business parties? Uh, Nos cuentas cómo comenzó, por qué eligió. Uh, how is how you start modeling? Why you like in uh, modeling? Uh, well, actually, start, I, I, I like to do everything with characters, really. But um, I started modeling because you need to start modeling, right? Um, my background in education, when I when I went to school, I learned to animate in 2D with pencil and paper. And then uh, I just, just discovered uh, Modbox and Maya and 3D and, yeah. You know where you might be, Max? No, no. Yeah, good for you. I started with 3D so much. Yeah. I started with Soft Image, actually. Ah, but Soft Image is pretty good so far. Yeah, it wasn't bad. Soft Image is pretty good. Yeah. Uh, so Diego Modo, yeah, Modo is good for hard surface. Modo is pretty good. Uh, Diego, he said, hey, Chris, are you focusing on characters? More in it than Yeah, I focus more on organic and characters and yeah, anything like that. Sculpting, it's more, just because it's more fun. I, I don't like to get focused on hard edges and, but. For example, if, here if, we have different departments to do all their Yeah, things. yeah. You generally you have a character department and a prop or set sets and props maybe department. It's always separated. But um, if you can model a character really well, you can model anything really. It's just a matter of yeah, taking the time. Maybe know? it is kind of technical, but here they have any like a maximum polygon, so do where you want, or they have it actually hey, try to don't go. To higher, like. there's not really a limit, but it just has to be for the character. It has to be riggable and it has to be animatable, deformable, and better to be lower so that you can animate in real time. So the animator can default use the rig, and it's not lagging. You know, they want to play back at 24 frames per second to see uh, the result. Eh, si alguien de pronto no entiende lo que dice él, me dicen, yo intento traducir, pero si, si nadie me escribe, vamos a seguir hablando en inglés, eh, todo eso, eh, excepto las preguntas que me hacen en inglés. Eh, ¿Qué te inspiró? ¿Qué te inspiró para hacer algo para hacer algo? ¿Cuál fue el principio para hacer algo para hacer algo? Ah, porque, no sé, es divertido, ¿verdad? Me gusta crear personajes. ¿Pero cómo te inspiró? Like, I mean, most people say, I saw big Ah, stuff. because, yeah, probably because I saw Toy Story. Oh my God. Every, every, everyone said this, the same shit. They have a different story. Everyone, I saw Toy Story. Yeah. No, but it, it made a big difference. I mean, before that, I was always interested in animation and I made little claymation movies, you know, with an old video camera. Yeah, and, with the stop motion. Yeah, like shit stop motion stuff. But, Fuck that. But, too hard. Uh, yeah. Bueno, well, well, supuestamente este man lo inspiró toda historia como todo el mundo. Se le pregunta a cualquier huevón que hace tres de siempre inspiró a película. Uh, as moment and because what? As a moment and because as and this had to be a moment. Yeah, so, what did he say before? What this guy? No cuento. This. It's a similar. Ah, sorry, eh, Edinka. Nos cuenta con no ya. Yeah. How you start? Eh, eh, how you choose more? Uh -huh. You already did it. Why choose modeling? Ah, why choose modeling? Yeah, I just yeah, I, I like it. I, I like to to play with clay as well sometimes. To, to well, model, uh, to sculpt. 
Diego Jimenez, what is the difference between two lead models? You know, yeah, what? even I don't know the answer to that. I mean, so it's so really, it depends on the company too. Sometimes y when yes, I was working before, a, a lead is a, yeah, it's just like kind of the best modeler in the team. He's but in charge, but he's not really the boss. Of in this case, it's not like that. It's not better than you, for example, the lead. Yeah, the lead is better than me. Yeah. For example, this lead is better than you. Yeah, but but Jill is like the supervisor, right? So. Yes. It's, it's a junior. But para animación cambia un poquito, pero es a primero es junior, después es a mid, después está es mid senior, después está senior, después está lead y después está el supervisor. El supervisor que controla todo y el que va a hacer todas las revisiones. Y el lead, I think lead is I think for me it's kind of the vice president when maybe the supervisor yeah, is not yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think yeah. For, for me here super, el lead is el, cuando no está el supervisor el encarga de hacer esas cosas de, de supervisor. Pero tiene más experiencia que los otros. El senior ya también tiene bastante experiencia y está después el que está mediano y el junior. But I think this is a different, the lead uh, supervisor. Something like that. The I supervisor. Mean, in the animation department, you maybe you have lots of leads. Yes, but the reason they're, they like, have, they're like the senior. But the reason they have so many leads in, in animation, they have like a different groups. So yeah, one yeah. group is one lead, yeah. other group, other lead. So it's kind of supervising this team, yeah. supervising this team. Now they have all their team, only the leads with the supervisor. If the supervisor uh, go to the supervisor team. Yeah, yeah, generate the modeling. Character team, it's gonna be not that big. So yes, it depends. It depends on the, uh, the the team. An animation is a little complicated because so many like have so many people. Yeah, it's an army. But for example, how many people in character uh, modeling. modeling you have here in Micros? We have uh, five. They right were from the people. Huh? How much? How many? How many will be the total? We have one more guy coming, so we should be six. Six people, yeah. and, and and that's quite big for what I'm used to as well. And uh, layout, no layout, no like a props. Props? I don't know. It's like maybe ten or something, maybe more. So, something more light. The 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 props. How many say for characters? But but you have like some people focus on the background, some people focus maybe more on props. Yeah. For some, in in the character department, we would do some props which are just for the characters as well. You know, so. Like a bag, like, like bags a, and things yeah. like work hats, that kind of stuff. Pero, pero en esa compañía tiene lo que decíamos, hay diferentes, está no solamente el modelado, no es todo el modelado, sino que hay un departamento de modelado, pero solo de personajes. En el caso de ellos tienen que hacer algunos props, pero son props que son del personaje, como las maletas, cosas de esas. Pero hay otro departamento que se encarga de hacer los environments, y hay otro departamento de modelado que hace los props, que son los escuas chiquiticas. Eh, Juanita Rubio. Um, how was your process when you were looking for a job? I mean, how was your job hunting? Well, once you have experience, it's a bit easier because you, the, the problem with your first job is they want you to have experience and it's impossible. It doesn't make any sense, right? So if you have a good reel, it will help. But yeah, how you once you have some experience and a good reel, then... But what happens when you don't have experience? For example, the people beginning to start a new job. But I was lucky that I started in doing basic stuff and then went to a small company where I could do lots of stuff and uh, yeah, carry on working in one department. Es que es lo que he escuchado mucho y creo que a mí me pasó también eso. Lo que decía es que me empezó con una empresa muy pequeñita y pude coger experiencia. Por ejemplo, en mi caso, yo cuando estuve en la universidad, yo hacía trabajos para empresas y así de a poquito puedo coger experiencia, pero lo que él dice es empezar con, con empresas pequeñas. Pero, por ejemplo, ¿qué advice to get a job o what kind of website you do for jobs? You have I, well, when I moved here, I, I just searched Google uh, Montreal CG jobs, VFX jobs, animation jobs. That's it. There's many sites yeah, here. Uh, see what's open but there's nothing wrong with sending your reel to um yeah even if they're not hiring you know just send them a reel just in case yeah, no, yeah. you have facebook groups as well in some cities which can be useful uh, do you know uh draw like a you just try like a you draw yeah a bit a bit uh, don't have to life drawing is really useful for character artists in general like life drawing for anatomy for uh, do you know that? Yeah, yeah. I mean, this is. I studied that. That's cool. 
uh, live drawing, animation, yeah, 2D. I was never that good because I went to 3D and carried on in 3D. But to understand, at least, even if you can't draw that well, just to practice, to, to teach your brain what is going on, you know, to try and get a better understanding of the body. And lo que, dice, lo que dice Chris es que si es bueno, si es bueno este dibujar, sobre todo por anatomía, pero que él no lo empezó, lo empezó, empezó a empezar como de lado, como de la pero te lo dejó, pero lo está tomando. ¿Y return again to the draw o no? ¿Y está completo esto? I just, for now I just do it, so it's yeah, not the same. Everything in 3D? Everything now in 3D, yeah. Most. Just, just for fun I draw sometimes, but it's just to doodle. But I should really uh, go to live drawing. Every now and then I might go to a live drawing class. Uh, Is the Nelson have like a, like a big question? Is uh, what do you advise? Um, I will read in Spanish first. Okay. I will translate. ¿Qué me, recu eh, me recomendarían? ¿Qué? ¿Qué recomendación me daría si estoy buscando mi primer empleo en Colombia, pero no me han dado un empleo porque no tengo experiencia? Like I say, like I. What advice to he he tried to find a job his first job, but nobody hired him because he don't have experience. What yeah, advice? This is, this is really a pain. Uh, get, I would say if you really have this problem, you can, you can maybe do something in the company. Maybe it's not what you want to do, but they must have something you can do. You know, it's something it's, Julian yeah. role like uh, even like me. I started tracking, uh -huh. uh, tracking match move. You know, camera, camera tracking, and, and this object tracking. Um, maybe layout or something more simple like that. Lo que dice Chris es que de pronto intente entrar a la compañía haciendo otra cosa que usted no les gusta, pero al menos intente entrar. En el caso de él, le tocó hacer match more, hacer eh, eh, camera tracking, y eso es lo que hacía, pero así entró. Mi advice que puedo decir, my, my, I want, voy a hablar primero con él para contarle cómo fue mi experiencia. Creo que puede servir a muchos de ustedes. Por ejemplo, what happened with me? I don't have too many experience in here. I do so many like, personal projects. I, I think I did a really good. My yeah, personal never, project. Never stop working. My, my personal project. And when people see the personal project was really good, they don't ask for experience. They already see your experience in your project. Yeah. So the real is more important than the experience. experience. If your real is really good, that's it. Yeah. Lo que le contaba este a. Um, a uh, Chris es que por ejemplo en mi caso de pelo yo no tenía mucha experiencia de pelo, lo que hice hice todo mi portafolio con trabajos personales, pero en mis trabajos personales pude dedicarle el tiempo que yo quería y hice lo que yo pensaba que era bueno y ya cuando vieron eso no les importó la experiencia sino que ya veían el trabajo que no tiene experiencia en horas de trabajo pero sí tiene experiencia en o sea tiene algo proof, tiene algo, algo para mostrar y así, así logré yo mi trabajo y por ejemplo aquí estoy y tengo apenas dos trabajos de experiencia en pelo y ya tengo un trabajo bueno acá como lead en, en esta producción. Entonces, si no, consigue, si no consigue trabajo, yo recomiendo dos cosas. Intente buscar una empresa pequeña donde usted pueda hacer algo o haga un portafolio. Busque, por ejemplo, si quiere ser modelador, busque cuál es el mejor modelador y haga un solo modelo que quede muy, muy, muy teso. Pero tiene que ser muy teso para buscar eh, práctica. Eh, this other question. On surface. Try to read so people. Uh, yeah, yeah, I can understand. But I, I don't do that so much hard surface. Read, uh, how do you, you should read the questions. Ah, so how do you do hard surface models with traditional modeling techniques in Maya, or do you use ZBrush and then retopology in Maya? But I'm new to ZBrush. Mudbox is rubbish. Mudbox is not good for hard surface, but ZBrush, yeah, it's pretty good for that. But it's not. <laughs> I don't know ZBrush enough. I've only learned it since I've been here. So I would normally just do it directly in Maya because you, you can keep a flat surface easier. You can keep hard edges. You can use creases, crease sets, or, or triple edge to keep hard edges. Uh, yeah. My question, when you, do, when you do modeling in, in, mod, in series, for example, here, you have to do the roto or other person do the topology? I do the rotor too, to, yeah. You have to do it? Yeah. That's important to not focus just on sculpting because in the end it has to be used by animation or another department. So you need to provide them with something usable. With topology. Yeah. In fact, with the sculpting we do here, it's not to use the detail. It's just a quicker way to feel the character. And then we retopologize 
in a lower res. Uh, so yeah. How is work in the company? For hard surface, I don't know because the prop department will do most of the hard surface. We we do our characters in in uh, Maya and ZBrush. But the question is how it's work in the company. Yeah, I, I guess he means for the hard surface, right? Hey, Diego, te refieres a la compañía, o sea, lo, lo, de, lo de la pregunta anterior, o cómo es trabajar en la compañía? Do you mean, okay, maybe it's like for me, uh, which one do you use for text or in part? Me, in your case, in, in my case, I would use Modbox or Mari. Uh, since we have the 3D texturing tools, there's no need a reason to go back to uh, Photoshop, Photoshop anymore. Yeah, I used to use Photoshop and uh, no, never again. Here, but you have Substance Painter as well. Here they use Substance Painter? Or no? they do, I'm not sure if they do. They're funny because they, I remember in the required they say Substance Painter, but I don't see any people here working in Substance Painter. I've never seen them using it, no. But Substance Painter is quite Pretty fairly good. new technology, the, the stuff you can uh, do. For me, I... But like it's, yeah, you're painting with materials more yeah. than just color. Exactly. Right? But yeah. it's, it's good to understand because we, we learned maybe the old way with Photoshop, right? Yeah. So we know where like a bump map and a specular map and everything, how yeah, to set it's it more up. easy, everything. Yeah. I can way. see exactly. Yeah. yeah. But Substance Painter is cool, but it's cool to understand, uh, I think, the how it works. Uh, so, for example, here, we only use Mari. So over there, the, for texturing, is pure Mari. Yeah. And they use Mari with a note, not with layers. They use actually notes. I use Mari uh, for I have to use Mari, I use for layers. Yeah, oh, <laughs> I use layers too. Yeah. <laughs> when they say like a layers, no, <laughs> with, they use with notes, like a, a it's complete uh, new for me. Oh, he says, yeah, the hot surface. Yeah. Oh, yeah, sorry. I'm about so that. I don't know because, the, like I said, the prop department. The prop department here are doing mostly the hard surface stuff. And so they are really bad. Huh? They are really yeah. bad. I I heard they do like a like a for the, with like a simple example. They do like a ball. It has really dense. Like oh a, yeah. Like it's really bad. Or like oh, it has so many. They have always complaining. They have yeah. always complained. Oh, wow. <laughs> but they, I think they use. Mostly Maya. They had, they can use ZBrush if they want, but they, they use only Maya. Where I see so far, they only use Maya. I think so. Yeah. Traditional modeling techniques in Maya, but I think it depends on the artist. It depends on the supervisor. Yeah, yeah. Uh, how is the flow or workflow model? Like, what's the workflow? The workflow for a model? Yeah, they give you like a like a some design or yeah. So we have like a blueprint or just like a rough. We will get a uh, concept art where you have the character maybe with color uh, very rough, free. And then you will get like a model sheet normally with a front, side, back view. Normally it has nothing to do with each other and you, you try to match them. But personally, I prefer to, to mix a bit the model sheet and the concept to get the feeling of the character from the concept because generally it's more, it has more personality, you know. It has more art. It's more accurate too. Yeah, it has more personality, for sure, more character. And then the, the model sheet will look very rigid and dead. Uh, but this is the good proportions, so I try to to mix. For, for example, I see the 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 yeah, the over there. Yeah. They do like a T pose, or here is like a almost. Yeah, like, yeah. They do like this or this normally? Uh, we are modeling with a T pose. You got this. Yeah. T pose. It depends on the production. Sometimes you do a T, sometimes you do like a more relaxed T. But generally, you want, you want to put the limbs in, in the middle of the potential motion. So, I don't know. T is can, the, the most common. I don't know if you can do here, but maybe I don't know the experience with people. But normally, you can explain the. The loops, for example, the face. Or can you explain a little bit how is the loops? Yeah, well, it's important that you you have to think how is the face going to deform, or not just the face, but how is it the, the character going to deform? Uh, if if you want to close the eyes, for example, you want to be able to have a pivot point in the corners of the eyes, and uh, 
you lay you lay your topology out on the face, for example, mostly in the same way as the muscles of the face are arranged. So you have the muscle around the eye, you have the muscle here, you want compression here, so you want to keep at least an edge. Uh, yeah. There's a really good example actually for them in general for, for a really basic simple topology. If if we can share a link with them maybe. Yeah. Where is the uh -huh. Is that Upor? No, it's not Upor. But it's any maybe one. Yeah, this this guy. He makes some really cool uh, examples. So this link. So aquí pueden ver un poquito de ejemplos sobre de topología, cómo se utiliza la topología. Oh, yeah, so bacán. You have you have a lot of explanation here for topology. Uh, there's not one way to make topology. You can do many different ways, but this is a, a good example of a base that can work for many faces. Are you ever working in virtual reality? No. No? No. I live in virtual reality. I feel like. <laughs> <laughs> uh, is necessary to texture in for. No, no, I don't think so. I'll that. Is necessary. You have to know texture in for a hair for modeling? No. But it's, can, it's cool to know the process because, for example, like me, when I make uh, my character, I help you out a lot with the hair. Fuck that. No, but it's but, cool. But at least, not, not texture, but I think sells more if you have the characters finished with texture and everything. I think they, they help you to sell your art artist. Yeah. Everything. Yeah, yeah. But I, in more than that, if you have like a good character, a really good pose, with, with look, character, I think sell more than text or you know, yeah, really yeah, yeah. rendering. The modeling is, is actually the most important phase, it's the first step, and without that, you have nothing. So, I think some of the best work I've seen on ArtStation is mostly like a grayscale clay render of just, just a Do you know what? Sometimes, texture. I see, sometimes I see people in ArtStation like a good model, like a gray, when they make text texture, it looks crap. Yeah. It you can ruin it, yeah. If, you, if you're not so good at texturing or shading, do don't, don't bother. Es lo que dice Chris, no necesario saber modelado, ni texturizador ni, ni pelo, que solamente que tenga una buena pose. O sea, si tiene una buena pose, que venda la pose, es perfecto. Que ha visto muchos personajes con clay y quedan perfectos. Lo que también hablamos es que muchas veces hay gente que hace la pose muy bien, se ve perfecto en gris o en, en clay, cuando le ponen textura, la caga. Entonces, si no sabe en textura, mejor déjelo en, en un color, pero de que la pose Say interesting the person, I interesting I have a question, okay, I, I tell the people too, when the modeling, most people try to do their own uh, designs, maybe it's not the best designs. Let me yeah. finish. Yeah, yeah. So my advice is they should find good art. Okay, I think if you have good art and good model, they can sell better than you can have like a crappy design and good model don't really sell. Yeah. Generally, I, I would agree. If, if you it's possible that they can have a good design of their own. Right? Yeah, but, but most people don't have good design. Most people know it's not normal. Yeah, maybe you don't realize it's not good design or I mean, generally. It's not bad that. to find like a, some art design no, of no, people. No. You say, and it's in a, base, the, this, this, this guy, you just say. Yeah, yeah, you can do an interpretation, for example, of something that you've seen, you know, um, maybe make it your own a bit, but it's also good to copy 100% a nice concept you find maybe even email the guy and ask if it's okay if you if you do a 3d version of it most people say yes they, and most people yeah, they'll say why not yeah of course and then maybe they can help you with retakes or if they have ways to make it more like their drawing or better okay let's see i said chris because me 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 busca me consejo para gente que está modelando es que pronto no haga sus modelos que busquen un diseño de alguien que les parezca muy teso muy bacano y haga el modelo, porque si el modelo, si el diseño es interesante, el modelo va a vender mucho más fácil, pero si intentan hacer un humano, pues, pueden hacer un, un humano, pero no, humanos lo venden en Turbo Squid, o sea, hagan algo interesante que, que pueda vender. Mm, Nelson, muchas gracias por este hangout. This is, this is what, uh, lo, hacen, lo, lo hacen en inglés, this is why I tell you, uh, they say thank you for this hangout, like I said, yeah. 
This may be, que es muy charro porque muchos de ellos, les digo en el interview, dicen, no, pero yo por qué hacer interviews y este, esto para qué. Yo digo, no, esto le ayuda a mucha gente para saber el workflow, inspiración, muchas cosas. Entonces, muchas veces eh, no es difícil convencerlos, sino que a ellos de pronto les parece chistoso hacer este interview. ¿verdad? Que, que, I tell like, most people say like, why they did the interview, like, I'm not the best. Yeah, exactly. I always I'm tell not, it, I tell you, it's help out the people to hear the new technique or how they work, like uh, the old experience. So I think it's nice to have this interview. So the old is this interview. Y lo que intento es hacerlo en, en español porque creo que es más cómodo para todos, pero si quieren otros artistas que sean en inglés, eh, aquí hay mucha gente que es muy buena gente. Eh, puedo seguir de props, otros de modelado, están de dynamics. Se me tiene que decir y yo intento conseguir otra gente. Um, Edwin, ¿qué mejor sin? Uh, what do you think is bet, the movie or video games? I don't know. Uh, I haven't worked in games. I was thinking about maybe next trying to work in games to see because it looks exciting. Huh? I see some cool stuff. But for modern, yes, maybe. For for example, for animation, it's what kind of boring. It's yeah, like cycles, a loop. Cycles, yeah, yeah. Uh, really the same for me here. Like a is modern. Yeah. I think it depends for. For more guys, for more yes. way, it's it's cool because you you do some sculpt, you transfer your details onto a uh, normal maps and yeah, I don't know, uh, I'm not sure, I haven't tried. Uh, Jonathan Kukui, que más parce rojo y Chris eh, llegué tarde. He say hey, normally people tell me like I'm rojo or red, like I tell you, my nickname are... um, rojo yeah. or red. So you say hey hi, red and Chris, I am really late. Llegué uh, tarde. We we're also late. Yeah, we're kind of late. Uh, Edwin, portfolio demo que portfolio uh, uh, demo que me recomienda para más. Do you have any like um, any like artist you can you like it to refer to people to can see the reel, so like uh, they can see another reel or what people you follow, you see is really good. Oh man, I'm terrible. I don't. I never remember any names, but uh, there's so many on ArtStation. You just have to to look at the pics, hit the pics button, uh, put put uh, digital 3D and there you go. There's so yeah, many. All of them, any of them. Yeah, you have you have ones who focus on detail, ones who focus on cartoon characters. Choose what you like. This is the you thing. work in animation, you want to work in animation, then choose cartoon. What, what do you advise? Like a, they should do like a from like a cartoon or hyper reality or what do you advise for you the real? I think first copy something if you're really, really new, copy something that's being done in 2D, maybe cartoon, maybe realist, whatever. Copy it exactly. Once you can do that, uh, you can do everything. You can do everything, yeah. I think. Mag, um, are you, uh, Mr. Mr. Simulator? Are you, uh, Mr. and more simulating the. the hang out. I'll get the question. Oh, that's. Uh, holy. I don't know. Eh, Mag, no te entendí la pregunta. ¿Y qué era la cuestión? No, I don't understand. You can say in Spanish, yeah. And, yeah. You can translate for me. The worst thing I don't speak English, I don't speak Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really bad. Este Johan, este Johan es un amigo super teso también. Les, les he topic. Ah, wait, wait. Diego is saying video reel or portfolio. What was the question he said before, Diego? Uh, Diego, Diego, Diego. Uh, but, but, uh, Video reel or portfolio. Ah, to make like for modeling to have video or just an art station, maybe? Wow. Is that the question? Yeah. But okay, the question is you should make like a your portfolio just stills or real like an uh, video. Okay. For me you have to be real animation, like a like I have to see I think it's it's, it's more easy for the for the, yeah, the yeah. recruiter or the supervisor to see one video than yeah. choose one thing, one thing like a many, so many times I've applied just with uh, my art station page. And then they've come back to me like, oh, hi, Chris, can you send a reel, you know? So I would say both. Uh, a reel is very important. An art station, it's, it's not hard to just take images from that reel and put them somewhere on a web page, right? Just still images. It's cool to have both because an image you can look at for a long time and focus the detail. A video you can really turn around your mesh, you can uh, zoom in and both. Jo Johan, Johan is a really good friend, right? Um, ah, no, es no, que yo intento hacerlo y eso que son muchas veces me cae difícil por el tiempo, pero no, yo siempre voy a intentar hacer 
es un hangout y lo que digo, si quieren otros artistas que hablen en inglés, yo no tengo ningún problema que aquí todos son super nice. No, she said like I actually thank you for the hangout. Ah, oh, no problem. Thanks to watch. Uh, Edwin, ¿cómo está la industria de competencia en parte? La parte what do you think the industry uh, about the, uh, the like competition? competition? Yeah, it's I, tough. It's, it's tough. Really, yeah, it's tough. But remember we talk about in our dinner. I think it's tough, but Montreal has really good opportunity. Yeah, right now, for example, maybe Canada in general or Montreal, I don't know, but. They they lack in in uh, experienced modelers. They expect they lack in maybe talented modelers. I mean, but for me, they have a lot, but there's also a lot of work here. But for me, I don't know. For me, what I think more they have so many people. More, okay, you yeah. start modeling. Yeah. So there's so many. So that's why you have to find like I have to the, the detail. So I think the details have to be focused or try to do job. Like I tell. If you actually have in your reel and you are stationed the hand, I say, if you don't oh, have yeah, time yeah. for do everything, just one thing, the hand, they look perfect, so I can see you, you focus on the details, and you have to, other, I tell the same thing, you have to find like a, you, when you do personal project, try to do faster you can, but not really like a slow, but you have to know how much time you spend. Yeah. If they ask you, okay, you do this really good, Thing for you take like a few months, two months. Yeah, but that's the problem. They they don't know. You show one thing on your reel, they don't know if you took like ten months, one day, half an hour. But they ask you. They, 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 they might ask you. But for example, the hand it was uh, one day, just one evening. Uh, as quick as I could, I did that. Uh, but it was a study. It's quick to do. Uh, to study yeah, like a for a person something small and do it quickly rather than a whole thing and spend months, get lost and maybe give up. Eh, Steven dice una pregunta: esculpir en círculos y retoporizar en malla es una parte de forma de modelar o es mejor hacerlo todo desde cero de malla? Lo que dijo él, ellos lo hacen, lo va a preguntar de dos maneras, pero ellos lo hacen en, en, en este caso, en esta empresa, lo hacen en círculos y lo hacen retoporizar en malla, pero antes trabajaba en, en Modbox. He has, um, normally you do uh, sculpting en círculos and retopology en malla o you do everything en malla? I every company will have either Modbox or ZBrush or both for you to use, so use it. Uh, it's quicker to make something rough in, in ZBrush. Maybe clean it up in Maya. When you retopologize, you can make you can clean the shapes, make them cleaner. Uh, uh, maybe you work really well in ZBrush and you can do almost everything in ZBrush. Don't but most use, people don't use Z remesher in that case. But most people use retopology in Max or Maya. In Maya case. Yeah. Uh, there's there's a girl here, for example, she uses Topo Gun, which is a bit old now, but Maya, you, you have the quad draw tool and Para la gente que llegó tarde, pregúntele a él sobre Max. I say the people that write late, so I ask him about Max or Maya. What do you think about Max or Maya? What advice? Maya. You see? And this guy is the uh, London and but but, but it doesn't London. matter really uh, yeah but, but fucking virus. if you have the choice go directly to Maya don't waste time don't playing. waste time exactly with fucking virus Blender as well I mean yeah oh, bl oh, wait, most people like here in Colombia it's like a kind of popular now Blender what you yeah Blender I tried it a long time ago like five years ago and I was like oh, no no but I hear it's good now so uh, yeah but for me like a, like I say always. It's a fucking free software and no company works. Few maybe companies now start working, but it's the industry don't work with Blender. Well, that's that's it. If it's free and no company is using it, they want to make money, so they should use it, but they don't. So that so, answers your question. Yeah, it's just my, if you can, if you have the choice. Uh, Chris, do you have uh, I, blend shapes? Yeah, sometimes I have to do blend shapes, um, but. Sometimes the animation department will do them, sometimes the reading department will do them, but normally the character department will do the blood shapes. Uh, for example, we have, the, we have one guy coming soon who's going to just do blood shapes. I know the guy. Yeah, yeah, don't, say, yeah don't say the name. Yeah, he don't want to, everyone knows. Okay. But you see, they live, they're waiting for you. They, they know you were, they, you're coming, so don't worry. Um, what do you think about the, the language? They affect... Uh, language? Yeah. Um, 
they, you have, you they look, speak mostly French here. Yeah, but you look here, you speak English. Uh, I speak a bit of French too, but not much. But yeah, I'm lucky I speak English. They hear everyone speaks English. They hear uh, they speak more French. Uh, yeah, but I think if you were to speak with you, they try to work with you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As long as look you at, know look at me. I don't speak English, I don't speak Spanish. I just sign. <laughs> In Luxembourg, when I worked in Luxembourg, I first arrived, I didn't speak any French. They spoke mostly French. It was fine, no problem. So, yeah. It's not so much a big deal, I don't think. That. Lo decimos por el, mi pelotudo. Sí, muy pelotudo. Pelotudo. He's Argentina too. Haha, <laughs> Maya. You see, Maya the best. Fuck that. Max no mierda. Deja de odiar a Max. Yo no odio a Max. Max is un virus. Don't, don't hate Max. I always say about Max, I don't like Max, seriously. I'm but Max is cool for some video game studios to use. Yeah, for video and games, some, yes. Uh, yeah, for video games. Yeah, exactly. They love it. Yeah. Everything you, in, you, you play. Because you and it's done. In, no, not like that, but everything you play for actual, yes, Max. Yeah. For, anim, for feature films, Maya. Yeah, feature films or animation, Maya. Yeah. Even for video games, not really. Yeah, because now they require good quality. That's why they moved to Maya. Uh, okay. <laughs> Did you see my video game, by the way, on my, on my YouTube channel? No. You have video game? I started to, to, to make one, yeah. Oh, know. we can show you. No, I don't ever see the video game. Uh, Harrison, hola, como están? Soy de Bucaramanga, Colombia. ¿Qué piensas de Blender? Uh, he asked, I think, the same question. What do you think about Blender? I don't know it enough. I see people are doing some cool stuff. You can sculpt inside the software, and I don't know, it seems cool, but I don't know it. No, 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 lo, really no lo conoce mucho, pero lo que también decíamos, la inclusión no lo utiliza. Entonces, eh, pueden hacer cosas gratis, pero pff, son colombianos. Nadie paga por software. Entonces, no hablan de huevo. No es que, I say, we're fucking from, from Colombia. We don't pay for software. So don't <laughs> give me the bull crap is free yeah. when they don't pay for nothing. So don't <laughs> give me the shit. That, it's free Blender when they don't pay for uh, Windows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So why you complain about it's free or not free? When if you're pay. the guy that uses Linux at home, then yeah, you plan. Hey, Juanita, have you ever used Top, top Gun for topology? I, if you have anything about it, probably. I I have never used it, but I've seen uh, there's a girl in my team who uses Top Gun. Who who uses it? Uh, Anne Sophie. Who? Anne Sophie. Anne Sophie is the girl. Yeah. Why did she? Use it? Why? I, I don't know. She she knows the software, so she uses it for retopology. But um. Maya is, uh, it's pretty good now. You have the quad draw tool in, in oh, it's Maya. Pretty, yeah. It's really good, yeah. I mean, I'm, I, when I started, I was retopologizing by extruding a uh, edge. It would take like two days. That's true what Mauricio say. Max has great yeah, tools does, for modeling. Yeah, it does have great tools for modeling. But modeling in the end for characters, it's uh, vertices and faces and that's it. It's putting the vertices in the right place. So for hard surface modeling, Maybe Modo or Modo. Max is better, but in the end, but in the end, ZBrush is better. For than example, that. here we don't have Max. No. If for example, if you ask for Max, we ha we can. They, use they it. maybe have a license for it, but yeah, like I said, like look, si ustedes saben Max, y de pronto son muy buenos, capaz que tienen el software lo compran. O sea, así que no hay casi problema en eso. If they like your work, they can probably work around so, yeah. stuff like that. You know? Or oh, they can teach you. They can move. To yeah, software. you can. Yeah, if you know Max, you can move to Maya. It's, it's not that difficult. It's a big deal. The problem when you know Maya to go back to Max, this will have the big deal. <laughs> hey, Edwin says Modo is better than Maya, right? Uh, I don't know. You found your mother. For a hard surface, yeah, probably. Yeah. Uh, Diego, I would agree. I think the reason Maya sucks. Do no, you use any plugin to do? No, it's easy. For characters, you you cut. You unwrap, it's done. You now it's pretty easy. You unwrap, you unfold, yeah. unfold is pretty the good. The new Unfold 3D is really it's good. pretty good. Yeah. Actually, we I saw so many people use the, what is the software? Um, layout, UV Layout? Yeah, UV Layout, yeah. We use UV Layout. Or oh, road, my. Roadkill as well, no? I don't know. That, I that see so many people is UV Layout. This is why I see so many people here. Aquí usan mucho es UV Layout. Okay, this image is pretty good. I would say that, for example, it's probably better to to learn how to do everything inside Maya, and then if you if you really don't like it, try the other software like Top of Gun and uh, uh, Roadkill or UV Unwrap, whatever. But 
I mean, you can do it all in Maya, you just have to take the time to understand how the tools work. Eh, Sebas, Scala user de su más cabeza de alfa. Suppose, yeah, I suppose Scala use a uh, Scala. There is three still max. Oh, yeah? What for? For what? For, who knows? Yeah. Maybe for the junior people or maybe for the secretary. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, UV layout. I heard pretty good thing about UV layout and area use, but it looks pretty good. I know. It looks simple, but sometimes it's a fucking circuit. But like you say, for me now, Maya had a pretty good tool. So yeah, I don't have to go even, to a Even software. like five years ago, I was just using Maya. And I People around me were complaining, but I never had any problem. They don't know how to do it. Yeah, yeah you just. Yeah. Uh, other question I have the front of for you, maybe. Um, no more questions from the from the guys. More questions for you guys. How long? What time is already? We already have. Well, you see, it's so fast. Now it's 55 minutes. Oh, yeah? I'm not kidding. One time we had like a one hangout, like five hours. Wow. Get people like a back and forth, like a, you don't you lose the time. Right? It's back and forth. And now here is the interviews by one, but before it's only person, their computer, and my computer. So it's uh, okay. we yeah. just kind of share the screen. Yeah. Um, the good thing before we share the screen, like we can show something. We actually we can share the screen if you want. Well, we're, the cookie plan, we have no idea, not okay. I think for show, I think yeah, for the not a good no, idea. No, idea for that. Not a good idea for you. Uh, no sé si tiene alguna otra pregunta. Ya yeah, casi el dijo, pues casi todo el mundo tiene aquel tiempo cortado. Mucha gente ha dicho que una hora. Entonces, si tiene otra pregunta, eh, me la hacen y él la puede contestar de una vez. Si no, ya casi vamos a cortar el hangout, que aquí ya son las 8 y este me de maricón. So you are fucking fine. No, I'm just kidding. It's like I just, uh, if they had any other question. Yeah, any other questions? Yeah. Are there microsoft muy estrictos con los, los triangulos? No, never triangles, but, but triangles is bad. The white reason is bad. Um, Why? Yeah. yeah. Because they... Deformation? They're deformation, they, they, you can't deform a triangle that well. Like I say, he... You, can, you can sometimes hide triangles in places where you don't see or have deformation, but... You don't need to use triangles. You can but, always use Que dicen no es que sean estrictos, no usan triangles. You don't use triangles. No. Yo no usan triangles o de pronto lo que dice que de pronto ponemos un lugar que no se vean. La razón por qué no utilizan triangles es porque cuando se deforma que hacen imperfectos. Eh, que es mejor freelance? Oh, ok. What do you think is the best? Freelance or work in some studio? studio? Yeah. Uh, I would say it's best to work in a studio first to get experience, to maybe learn to work faster, to work in different departments. Uh, uh, freelance is probably great, but later, I would say. For me, I would say, is, at least for me, I like being in a company to be with other people. Yeah, to, but I can you learn more. more, from all, right? you, huh? learn more. You, learn you learn more. You learn more. And it's sometimes kind of hard freelance to give you have to know you have to find your clients, yeah. talk to the clients, and do your work. Yeah, and they might so, fuck you. Yes. And you've got nothing. Yeah. It depends on what you say. For example, it says that it's better to company to get experience. De pronto, in the future, si you ser freelance. Yo, por ejemplo, sigo que es mejor trabajar en compañía. A mí me gusta más en compañía. Porque también es, la, es algo bueno conmigo. Aprende más, tiene más experiencia que ser freelance. Chris, eh, les entregan previamente. Yeah, sí. El, he asked if they have you preview like a concept art. Yeah, they, we have concept art and, and model turn, turn tables, turn sheets. Normalmente tiene eh, el blueprint y también tienen concept art también de los, de los modelos. The both, normally the both. Both, yeah. Uh, and all, they, también tienen aquí okay, un concept art. Si ellos necesitan más yo referencia, se lo dibuja y le hacen los retweets. So you have like a concept art, if you need more information, they draw for yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. Generally, the concept art will have more character inside. More, you see more the the character. The model sheet, normally, it's very flat and very dead. And sometimes you will only have the concept art. Uh, and this is more fun because you can kind of... Do what you want. Yeah, you, you want. can do more what you want. But. Uh, when you are sculpting in series, do you use Wacom Tal? Aquí siempre. Todo, todo salió para hacer este pelo, utilizo Wacom. Aquí lo bueno, aquí usted dice, yo quiero una Wacom grande, chiquita, lo que usted quiera. 
do you use Wacom? He said, do you use Wacom yeah, or, or, or Cintiq? I have tried both, and I prefer using a Wacom tablet. For ZBrush, because you, you can see, yeah. Okay, so, you know what I mean? Yeah, right. I saw a few people working here in Cintiq, but it's more like a people in concept. Yeah, like 2D, you, it's better for Cintiq. So you, you, if you require it, they can give you for you or no? I think if I ask, yeah, they would give you one. But yeah. I, I prefer just a tablet because my hand is in the way of the 3D model and I don't see enough. For 2D, it's better because you're just, yeah. Aquí solo bueno, por ejemplo, en este caso, yo he visto que todos acá tenemos dos monitores, unos más grandes que más pequeños, todos son como Wacom y hay varios Cintiq. Es usted pide lo que quiere y se lo dan. Al menos en esa compañía. At least in this company, you ask, you like, give you. Yeah, you can have what you want. Yeah. What you want. Um, how many times you can take for a hero character? Or how do you really do yeah, that? It, it is. But normally, normally, just for the modeling, um, yeah, a character. Something between five to ten days, maybe. Maybe more if it's really a. It depends the budget as well. Maybe you have retakes and retakes. This is what retakes. It's perfect. Maybe it's something more simple. But average, I would say. Eight, ten days. Eight, ten days. Yeah. Mm. What do you think about the money? They getting lower or higher about the competition? It's getting uh, the price for getting the job. It's getting lower or higher? Yeah. What do you mean? Sorry. For example, now it's more competition. You see, they, uh, they okay. ask you about the new job. Yeah, with salary or no, because less. there's so many people, they can pay us less. I think. Yeah, or the more, more, more. So they have more competition. So at least in your case, it's always the same salary or getting better. Or sometimes it's, it's getting better as I get more experience. experience. Yeah, but I think it's always like that, right? Yeah, getting the problems in Colombia. I remember a long time ago. I think maybe like a, I don't know more than twelve years. I made one money, for example, two thousand dollars. Yeah, and now they pay two thousand dollars. So if there's so many people, they pay less, 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 less. Yeah, they will always try and pay you as less they can everywhere. I think. This is my some companies are better. This is my response. I said I told with few people. Most people say, "Hey, you still don't work like our time." They hear the the industry. I think more here is when people, if whatever ask you how much you make, nobody said how much you make. I think if everyone know how much you make, yeah. then you can. You can, yeah, you, you, can, can ask more you can ask more. You can ask more. Don't know, uh, if nobody knows, they can. I think yeah. this is the big problem. But the problem is that people, when they ask me how much you made, and you say the people can be jealous or they will be pissed, or they yeah, say, hey, they pay you this, they have to pay. So I think if the people react good, they don't blame for your mistakes. So just learn, but don't don't blame or don't try to, hey, pay me more for it. They pay you more for this guy. I think it's a problem. But they, everyone should know. How much they may so you can at least they know. Should know how much they're worth, right? Yeah, yeah. But it's, it's always like but a problem. If you want to get rich, don't don't do this job to get rich, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> eh, por último, unos pequeños consejos. Pero, eh, what do you, que for the what do you like a advice for a mother like a tips? What tips? tips? Um, I would say speak with other people. Other artists, 2D, uh, textures, whatever friends you might have, don't just work on your own. And, and you know, I think it's important to to share your work, maybe on a forum, on a website, or something like that, to share information. Voy a compartir con ustedes aunque ya los compartí en el Facebook. Voy a compartir el art station de él. Ahí se le pueden escribir o pueden lo pueden seguir a él um, a Chris. Este, este es su artation, entonces ahí le pueden de pronto escribir. Mm, Sebas, Chris, do you, uh, thank you so much for your time. That was Luis. Now we're now on the same okay. Let me read first. Ah, so. eh, que no entiende un carajo. Prefiero oír. <laughs> he said thank you for you, thank you for me for taking the time. And he he said that he prefers uh, hearing his English than his Spanish. Oh yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Lewis is not bad, huh? With English, <laughs> no, I'm really bad in all English. I don't sound the same. Uh, cabrón. Uh, Diego, thank you a lot, Chris, for finishing your work. It's fantastic. Yeah, he's pretty good. I don't know what that means. What? Fantastic work. 
for finish your work in fantastic. I think for your portfolio, what that mean, or what, what uh, Diego, that big problem in Colombia is you don't have co companies yeah, yeah, yeah. where you take it experience, yeah. But then then work on your own uh, reel, uh, take, take the time to, yeah, just, if, I mean. If I join another, another country, that's it. Try another country, yeah. Uh, I mean, I I chose this job because I enjoyed to do it. When I had some free time, I would do some some modeling or play around. You know, it's still it's why it's why I do this because I just enjoyed to do it. So I don't know about you, but it's more that than because I wanted a job. You know, for me, yes and no. For example, for me, I have to have like a project. For example, I have my own project. It's called Ride With Me. Yeah. So this is in my free time. I do three with my personal project. But for me, it's kind of where you have, but for me, I have to find like a reason behind. Okay. I have to have like a, my own personal project yeah. to do something in 3D, not just, I want to do some hair, but no, I have to, okay, this project, or this character, I have like a, have like a plan, not just like a, ah, to I want to draw something, no. Yeah. For me, I have to find the reason to do something in 3D. In my case, I strive to do like a, some, a, like a feature film, Call right with me. Ah, okay. Hey, you want to make a picture for yourself? I I will show you. I have like a. But most people here they follow follow me for this reason for this okay. uh, feature film. I don't know yeah. this guy. <laughs> I only met him today. Actually, <laughs> I, actually, I want to try to 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 pitch to the client and to makers to. The, the ah, project. you said actually. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah I'll I will try to make the pitch for for do here. Um, guys, is for hangout. Some girl, you know, and they say uh, thank you for the hangouts. Uh, it will help a lot. They say more issue. No, I hope it's helpful. Uh, I'm maybe not the best, the best guy. To no, know. yeah, everyone have their own, their own like a uh, uh, experience. It can help a lot. I think so. Yeah. Este si quieren, me dicen de qué otro tipo, otro invitado quieren, si de layout o de props o qué otro artista. Okay, well, in in Espanol, I as animadores, I want to bring the producer, Manuel, but I think it will be hard to find actually the time to with him. Yeah? Yeah, he's always busy. I, I think he will, be, he will find time eventually. Okay, sure. productor Espanol. Uh, thank you, Nick. Thank you, Red. Uh, Die what Diego was saying, some companies outside say good job, but unfortunately you don't have experience. Yeah, this is a really common problem at the beginning. But like I say, if, when you, you're look, if, you, if you have a good portfolio, they, they don't care about your experience. No, no, no. no but, but work on your portfolio, but don't just work alone. Like, ask uh, professionals or friends or anyone. <laughs> they, yes, they have a woman. Is any woman? They have a woman? Yeah, working here. They have women, yeah. They have pretty good here. Yeah. For, yeah. I prefer to say names because maybe they, they, they listen. Are, they have pretty good uh, girls here. They have girls, yeah. yeah. That's all I'm saying. That's it, period. <laughs> it's not, it's, man, Columbia, they changed. Before, I remember, there's not any girl and was made me feel like a really bad. But now, Columbia, I saw a few people, a few girls, like a really. Yeah. Good artist. Yeah. <laughs> really good artist. But uh, there is still more guys than girls, but it's it's, uh, it's here, getting better. They have here in animation, in layout, they have so many girls, yeah. yeah. And they pretty I find, I find in 2D animation there's more girls and in 3D there's a bit less. Yeah. Right. Uh un punto de vista red red vestido mujer. Say me like a in the woman, like a dress like a woman. I mean, you dress like a woman. No, he's don't say nothing. Uh, this is the you're waiting for. He's the guy, the plane shape. Ah, okay, okay. You don't say nothing, but but you're waiting for one guy, you know? Yeah, waiting for one guy, yeah, for the plane shapes. So, the blind you shapes. see, yeah, they're still waiting for you. Apparently, that's what I hear. Yeah, well, actually, what they say, they you'll say something. He just said, uh, yeah, we're waiting yeah, well, for this said, guy to... He said something about his problem or, the, or just waiting for him? No, he just... Or they, he, he doesn't know. Maybe he doesn't know. Maybe either. he doesn't know. I think he should write the email. Hey, Jill, maybe he don't have the email to Jill. 
Maybe no, Jill tried to push, hey, we need this guy, but you really need this guy right now. From what I hear, is the last thing I heard today is he's still coming. Okay, yeah. But you see? Yeah. You see? There's but still... I had to wait a long time also for the, my How, how long are you taking for your visa? Uh, maybe two months, I think. Uh, pff, you see? Maybe, maybe just a bit less than two months. <laughs> this is the thing. Here, yeah, here, like, uh, the visa is well, it's quite... You can you have to... It's every every person has different case, but it's kind of hard to come to different country. Yeah. Yeah. But don't worry, you'll be here. We're waiting for you. Eh, Brian, alguna persona que trabaja en texturado Substan? Eh, en esta compañía no hay ninguna persona que trabaja en tu, en, en Substan, pero si si puedo preguntarle a alguien de texturing, que es trabaja con Mari, pero si puedo conseguir a alguien de texturing. The more, last, more people use Substance in video games, I think. Yes, no, but, but for me, the future. But the future will be Substance Painter. Yeah, yeah. It's so fast, yeah. so fast, and more than that, you can you don't have. Okay, here, for example, you do the your your texture in Mari, but they go to Katana to do the render. But what happened in Substance Painter? They can do your texture in Substance Painter. If they can right away to see the rendering. But rendering an on that substance? No, but at but least you can see it was You can see uh, you can see close. pretty pretty yeah. close. Yeah. Diego, the last, how big is the modeling department in Micros? Uh, we have... But you have to be, it's not, ju it's not just modeling, it's modeling in different departments. Character, Characters uh, sets. Uh, sets, and props. We had we have three different departments for modeling. Yeah, for Characters example, we in have characters, like five right now. Right now, it will be, it will be six, six by character. the end of the project, at least. Uh, we have... Uh, I don't know, like 10 or 12 in props. props. Yeah, in environment. An environment is yeah, even more, but then you have also the layout, which is taking the layout, that. And the layout is not more. Not really, no. But, but layout is not a bad way in. For getting the image? Yeah. The yeah. Club, they don't have yeah, movies. Yeah, you do everything right too. Yeah, no more than that. They don't have any, they don't do movies. It's like I would really wear in 3D. They start doing movies. Microcine web, yeah. Actually, le voy a compartir el, el teaser donde. Do you do, what do you do for the teaser? Do you do any characters? Or? No, it's not mine. No. <laughs> they, they were already done. Yeah, you did the hair, right? Yes. Le voy a mostrar este. Le voy a mostrar esta página de Micros, eh, donde estamos trabajando los dos. Y le voy a compartir con ustedes el teaser donde la película que estamos trabajando. En mi caso, yo soy. Supervisor or lead? Ah, no, sorry, let's compartir la que no era. Micros Animation. Is that also yes? Or no? Yeah, it's the, this is the, the no. model website, right? No, the, hey, ah, back. yeah, that's funny, yes, yeah, yes. So, but it's like Canada. Voy a buscar este. Eh, el teaser de la película. Se llama Stabby de American. Stabby de. ¿Qué es eso? Stabby American Hero, right? Yeah, I think so. So we'll be. What? More settings? No. I'm not confused. You sure? Uh, I can. I want to copy the link. If you click the video. No, you don't. No, have to. And if you hit the share button, you can't copy the link. Oh no! Wow. Si le no buscar cómo copiar el el link directamente para que lo puedan ver ustedes. A ver si. Ah, Facebook. Voy a compartir el el fanpage de del proyecto. La verdad, no sé cómo compartir con ustedes el... Es muy que no tiene ningún Vimeo. Debe tener like un Vimeo. No, debe estar en YouTube, por lo menos. Sí. Eso. Ah, creo que tal vez... Sí. En este link pueden ver el, el teaser de la película. Ahí me tocó hacer toda la parte del pelo, del perro y el, del personaje principal. Los dos son personajes principales que me tocó hacer. Eh, José, hola, buenas noches. ¿Cuál programa de render usan para mostrar sus modelos? 
algorithm. Do you have any advice for any like uh, engine for rendering? For do you? Uh, I really like Arnold. I think it's amazing. It's yeah. really, really good. You have some some GPU renders, some real time renders now, which are quite good. But I, I don't know. I just like I like Arnold. It's it's easy to use. It's easy to use. I'm pretty uh, good it's, Yeah, it's it's artist friendly. Really artist friendly. Uh, I don't know. Micro have internship? I don't think so. Me neither. I don't no. think so. No. Because they don't. Yeah, they don't want to take the time. If you are really new, you take time from somebody else to, to train you. Uh, you know. Yeah. Uh, Diego Jimenez. Uh, are you able to portfolio review? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Man. Do you have any, do you want to share the email or do you want they send me in the email that I send it to you? Maybe, yeah, send send to Red and then I will. Uh, I will, they have, I normally use the, not my personal email, I use the, my project email. Yeah. So I want to, voy a compartir con ustedes el reload, el, el correo de, de, de Illusion. Y ustedes me mandan el correo a mí y yo se lo envío a Chris. Y así pueden hacer el, portal, el review. Yeah, you can forward to me, right? Yeah, I'll forward to you. Este es el correo, entonces cualquiera que quiera hacer un review de modelado, me lo manda a mí, yo se lo mando a... a you can give your opinion too, though. Yeah, but... Voy a decirlo, I will tell... I have few experience the people ask the same question about review. If we take the time, not just me, all the people take the time, and they cry for the fucking review. Yeah, they, yeah. Like, like, let, me, let me finish. I tell all, all, all the time, if you ask for review, take it. Yeah, take yeah. the review. Maybe, maybe it's not the best review. Yeah. Maybe it's not true. But don't complain, because they take your time. And more than that, if you want to people say, you're amazing, fly your mom. And your mom say, that's beautiful. That's you perfect. have to get used to, to being knocked back. Look, more than that, if by you, the girls, but well, no more than that. If you don't take your feedback for somebody else, what happened with the supervisor when they tell when they ask you? Oh for, yeah, yeah, that's a so. You this have is, to get used this to, is to, the, to that. more than that. You're not supervisor. You have to be used to, to the the feedbacks. Maybe yeah. it's, it's not. Uh, it's not. Um, what is it called? It's not uh, the right or it's not true. But it's advice. You take it where you want, but don't complain. Okay, one time I hear in Facebook, ah, I don't know why I'm asking for reviews. Uh, happened to this. So, <laughs> so don't ask for reviews. Yeah. If you want to get better, you have to. Yeah, lo que, lo que estoy diciendo es que hay unos que lloran. Y Felipe está diciendo porque justamente hicimos un review. Mucha gente tomó el tiempo para hacer un review. Y después vi en Facebook llorando porque, por los reviews. Entonces, si quieren reviews, eh, no tome las cosas personales, la gente está tomando el tiempo para hacer reviews de ustedes. Y además, si no saben tomar reviews, ¿qué va a pasar cuando estén con un supervisor? El supervisor le va a hacer reviews. Por ejemplo, uh, today, we have to, like, a, the, the uh, concept art, they tell me, like, a feedback about my, my hair. I have to take, okay, I do it. Uh, Tienen que escuchar los feedback. O sea, tómenlo bien y, y escuchen los feedback, porque si no saben tomar un feedback, no van a poder trabajar en equipo. Entonces, eh, mándenme todos los correos, en buena onda, yo tomo el tiempo para mandárselos a ellos y ellos me lo mandan a mí, son de ustedes, o yo también, I normally take my opinion, I take my opinion just when I know, for example, animation, I prefer to do it because I'm not good at animation, yeah. but a uh, few but, times I, I do my feedback. I, but I remember the last problem was with the song guy with, uh, with the art, he was like a kind of concept, and he cried on Facebook like, ah, rah, rah, rah. and and the guy did the feedback for him. He did it pretty good, and they don't take pretty good feedback. Like uh, Felipe say, "Fucking llorones." <laughs> they just cry, babies. Yeah. Uh, Plenty what, of work that I do, I I do uh, just to practice, and I don't do anything with it. I don't finish it. I throw it away. But you learn something, you know. Yeah, but you so have, you, you can't be precious with it. It's just a piece of Oh, it, you don't think like what is it about it's just people? an image in the end. Whatever you make, it's don't feel uh, it's and, and more than that, it's hard, have, but you have to separate. You have to separate it with with kind of artists, but in the, I always say we are like a puppet yeah. case. We have to follow the the, in the, the idea in the of job, the people. Yeah, yeah. The job. that's why. That's it's not why, our work. That's right? why I say 
you have to do personal project. In personal project, you can do the best you can, the best at least you, you think you can. Yeah, you can do what you want. Exactly. Well. No one's telling you what to do. Um, is this, do you say, what program do you use for texturing? Mudbox or Mari, yeah. but I, I want to learn the substance painting because everyone keeps talking about it. So. I have like a one course with in Spanish. I do like a free course in yeah, substance yeah. painter. Um, I can teach you super something that was easy. It's pretty good. Felipe is también muy bueno para hacer feedback. Yeah. No, Felipe va, es bueno y más va al punto. Eh, que llorones, aunque en mi caso, gracias a tu review rojo, estoy metiéndole hace un mes a mis personajes a full. No, acá, ¿no? Pues lo que digo, lo, en serio que lo, yo al menos yo lo hago, te lo juro que los feedback y los hangouts lo hago al menos de corazón, porque a mí me hubiera gustado que en mi época alguien se tomara el tiempo para hacer eso. Por ejemplo, yo hoy no fui al gimnasio para hacer el hangout. Y me tocó tomar cerveza con este para poder acompañar, algo que estoy intentando tomar. Entonces, intenten tomar las cosas de buena, de buena onda. Si aquí no está... Te lo juro que muchos de los que he intentado rodearme de los hangout y de los feedback son gente que quiere intentar a, dar su punto de, de opinión y algo bueno para ustedes. No lo están haciendo por ni por cagar, ni están diciendo cosas por malo. Entonces, tomen las cosas en buen sentido. Um, yo creo que vamos a dejar ya. Do you think it's good finish right now? No? I think it's all. If you have any, si tiene otra pregunta, de una, hágala. Yeah, I think if these guys want to send you their, their demo, their review, whatever, we look at it. Yeah, I, uh, yeah I, I send my, my okay, email. Yeah. So they send my email, I send to you. Um, you still send Google Translate. <laughs> they have to Google Translate whatever you say. Yeah. Yeah, no sé si tiene alguna pregunta o en caso voy a dejar, eh, voy a intentar buscar otra persona. Voy a ver de qué departamento este sería el próximo invitado. Ah, no, I forgot. Maybe el, el próximo voy a traer un pelado que trabajó en Sony en trabajar la película de, la, de um, Los Pitufos. Uh, Jonathan, he worked in, in Sony for Layout. Jonathan, the guy in Layout. Uh, he yeah. Layout. He worked in Sony for... Uh, yeah, he worked in Vancouver. Voy a te puedo traer una persona de, de Layout. He, este trabajo en Sony es súper buena gente. Oh, this is your next uh, victim? Yeah, maybe he will be, yeah. I, I tell him he would be like a good fit for the, the Hangout. Entonces, de pronto va a ser este Layout. Eh, no sé, vamos a ver qué, a qué otro traigo. Entonces, de pronto el próximo va a ser de Layout. A menos se va a contar la experiencia, por ejemplo, porque él, él acabó de salir del colegio. I think he don't have too many experience. I think he only have Sony and this company, that's it. Okay, well, Sony's a good company, right? It's his free job in Sony. Lucky bastard. Lucky bastard, yeah, exactly. Yeah. He was really lucky. Este, parcero, entonces yo creo que vamos a dejar ya la hangout, a menos que alguien te haga una pregunta. Eh, hey, Diego, we will get back to you. Okay, ah, vamos a ver si lo mandó. Yo te lo mando de todas maneras. Ah, oh, yeah. I wonder, yeah, they've already sent two people. Yeah. Okay, cool. Thanks, I'll guys. We'll have a look at it. I will send you uh, tomorrow. Thank you so much. Muchas gracias. Delete. 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 Wait, Jonathan. Let Jonathan. No. No entendí. You hear? In the night, you hear, start hearing things. Yeah. Yeah. Echoes and. Uh, uh, the order with Felipe, we had, uh, we're talking like here, hang out with him. Oh, we start hearing things. In here, I don't know why in the kitchen. I start hearing things and there's nobody here. Maybe it's haunted or something. Yeah, I don't know. Fuck that. Or it could be the cleaner. No, the cleaning cleaner and they left was like at 12 p.m. It's uh, no fucking nobody here. Shit, yeah. That's it's funny. Yeah, you see the fucking phantasmas, the fucking ghosts. Eh, Listo, parceros. Yo creo que los va a dejar. Run, bitch, run. <laughs> eh, yo, después, cuando tenga la próxima persona para el hangout, le voy a avisar. Le voy a avisar. O si quieren algún tipo de otro hangout de, de otra persona, me escriben al correo. Vamos a poner otra vez el correo para algún eh, review. O si tienen alguna como una idea, algún hangout, me dicen, lo hacemos. Eh, también les voy a dejar otra vez el, el link del, del teaser para que le echen un ojo y lo critiquen. Este no hizo, what? bueno, they really don't have any character. Uh, 
Foi de outros. Try to find. Ok. Voy a compartir otra vez el teaser de la película que estamos trabajando. Ahí están para que, para que lo miren. Y nada. Un abrazo a todos. Chao. Cool, guys. Bye.